Hi everybody, today I am going to teach you how to use forms in Excel. I am going to teach you three methods by which you can create forms in Excel. In the quick access toolbar, in the form icon in home tab and in a new tab. A form contains controls such as boxes or drop down list that can make it easier for people who use their worksheet to enter or edit data. This is a very, very useful tool in Excel. Now let us see how to create the form button in quick access toolbar. It is very difficult to manually enter in an Excel. You can see there are large amount of data. If you want to enter in an Excel sheet, it is very difficult. So now we are going to insert this data in a form-like manner. For that, go to File, click Options, click Quick Access Toolbar. Here select All Comments. In this All Comments, you select Forms, F-O-R-M, Form, yeah, it is there. Now you can add this here. The form icon can be added here. Click OK. Now you can see the form icon is there in the quick access toolbar. This quick access toolbar can be set at the top also. For that you can click options. Click quick access toolbar. To quick access toolbar below the ribbon. You can unselect and click OK. So that means it will be at, at the top of the ribbon. So once again, I am clicking, click File Options, Quick Access Toolbar. I am going to keep this Quick Access Toolbar below the ribbon. Click OK. Now it is available here. Okay. Now, if I select this and click this Form option, you can see it is like a new form. Now, suppose if you want to add a new data, you click New. You can type the register number, name, everything you Now let us create a new Excel book. Here I am going to type the name. I am going to enter the marks for different subject. Industry 4.0, Marketing Management, Services Marketing and Lab. So let me select these headings and if I click form Microsoft is asking whether we can select the first row as the form heading okay so we are going to click this and click OK now you can see the name industry 4.0 mm services marketing lab is available now if I type the name as KTS and the marks different marks for different subjects I'm typing so you can see this record will be added. You can see the record is added. Now I am going to type a new name Vasubhati and I am going to type the marks for each subject. And you can see if I click new, it will be automatically added. So instead of typing in Excel cell by cell, you can this use this form method. If you want to have your form icon in the home ribbon, click file, then click options, click customize ribbon, select all comments, select form, select form. In the home tab, you can add, but you have to create a group so that you can add it select new group in this group you can rename that group name as form and you can give an icon to it and click OK now you select and add so that form will be added in the new group icon click OK now you can see here this form is available here you can click this so that you can enter the data easily. Now I will teach you a method so that you can have 
this form as a tab we have made a form as a quick task icon we have used that in the home ribbon now we can have this in the tab for the click file options click customize ribbon and here you select all commands then click form click form now you can create a new tab click new tab we will rename the tab as form tab so this is the form tab you can also rename the group as form now you can add this so you can add any number of options in this if you want to add this formatting formulas I'm adding a lot of things in this form and click OK now you have a tab called form you can see in this form you can have the format formatting formulas everything okay this is the form tab for more videos like this subscribe our channel edu crawl you can forward this video to all your friends and relatives during this COVID period, these types of videos will be very, very useful to them. Please share. Thank you.